The trick is to get yourself a glass that is specifically issued by the Sapporo company. As you can see, there is a star engraved at the bottom of those Sapporo labeled glasses. We might think that the star symbol is there for mere aesthetic purposes, but it is not the case. To begin the experiment, you open up a bottle of beer and pour the content within the glass. The star is visible from outside the glass, but it is in fact engraved within, on the section that touches the liquid. As you can see, the bubbles of carbonic gas form themselves solely around the star carved at the bottom of the glass. That is pretty cute, but it's not exactly what will impress your friends. However, it is precisely that phenomena that we will pursue. First of all, simply drink your beer normally until only two inches of liquid remain at the bottom of the glass. Then, take your glass to a location where it will not be moved or touched for about 20 minutes. The perfect settling time depends on the type of beer you use. But in every case, sooner or later, a star-shaped foam will begin to float on the remaining of the liquid. Wait until the shape of the star is satisfactory to your standards before you can show it to your friends. Then you can say something like, Whoa, what are the odds of getting a shape like that? The drunker people are at your party, the wilder the theories will be on the cause of the phenomenon in question. Have a bit of fun by suppressing the more scientific and logical explanations while promoting and encouraging the most outlandish and esoterical ones. Don't fear for your secret in the process. The carbonic gas that will rise around the engraved star will be practically invisible. Have fun! <laughs>